Hi, I'm Michaela from Vacuum Cleaner Market. I'm here to tell you a little bit about the comparison of these two Dysons. So we have the Dyson V10 Animal and the Dyson V11 Animal. So I'm gonna tell you a little bit about the differences within these two models. So we'll start with the V10 Animal. So this model does come with the several attachments. You have your crevice tool, you have your dusting brush. This brush does have a separate lining of red velvet fabric. So if you were to do your baseboards, you don't scratch them. And then you also get the dusting combination tool. This one does have a button that releases it back. You do have an added crevice tool with another ve red, velvet, red velvet piece of fabric. Then you get your added upholstery tool with the spinning brush roll right beneath. Um, it does have the added red fabric. This is really good for doing your upholstery on your couches. You can even do your mattresses or your dog beds or cat beds. This, does, this model does come with a carpeting attachment. This attachment does have a spinning brush roll on the opposite side, um, has several different bristles. So you can get deep and down into your carpets. It does have the carpeting adjustment, height adjustment. Um, there is a lever right here that you can turn to either the right side or the left to adjust it up or down. Both of these models do have the same carpeting head, just different colors. Um, still has the height adjustment on the front and the spinning brush rolls on the back. So now for the V11 animal, it does come with the same attachments. You have your upholstery tool with the spinning brush roll. You have a more rough dusting brush, has a little bit rougher bristles. So if you do have cat or dog hair stuck onto your couch, um, a mat or your carpeting, you're able to get really deep down and scrub that out. Another amazing feature about the V11 animal is you have your attachments stored on your hose. So it comes with this added attachment. Only V11s come with them. Um, to add your attachments directly on your hose. So you technically have an integrated tool storage. So you go ahead and push this little button that attaches it, just like you would attach it directly to whether it be your hose or the handheld model. And then just to click it back in, you can pop it back in. You can also change the attachments. So if you wanted to carry around your rougher dusting brush, you can attach that right here as well. just like that. Very nice feature. It's gonna save a lot of time and you won't lose as many tools. This model does also have the same dustbin, same dustbin container, so same holds the same capacity of dirt. The only difference of the canisters or the um, handheld models is going to be the screens. So on the V11 Animal, you have a LED lighted screen. So if you were to push this button, you can change it from Eco to Auto to Boost. You can also see your battery lifetime. Plus if you need to change your filter or if you need to take it to Dyson for maintenance. What's nice about this model is that it has an auto mode. So if whether you're vacuuming carpeting, hardwood floors, your upholstery, it's gonna change the suction rate for you so you have a longer run time. Um, auto is going to give you the longest run time as well as eco. Um, so for the eco mode, you can on average get about 60 minutes, um, but it does depend on what attachment you're using. For the V10, this model, the suction adjustments are a lever that goes up and down. Your battery life is shown on the side right here. Plus if you need any maintenance or if your filter needs to be changed. Both of these models still have the washable filter that you remove by turning and pulling out. 
still same washable. Um, I would recommend to put it aside for 24 to 48 hours to let it completely dry before putting it back into your model. So now with the filters, we recommend to change them every six months just so that you're getting a very high filtration rate. So that's the difference between the V10 and V11 animal. You're gonna be looking at the different suction rates, the LED screen on the 11, and also this very handy um, tool storage on your wand. Um, if you have any other questions, feel free to chat us on our website. You can give us a call or email us. We're always available. We're US-based customer service, and we're here to help. I'm Michaela with Vacuum Cleaner Market. Happy vacuuming.